Welcome, everyone. We begin tonight in New Haven with that alarming string of overdose cases. It prompted a citywide health alert. Tonight, we have updated new information from police. We now know that four people overdosed. Tonight, one of them is on life support. And what's behind it? K2 synthetic marijuana. News 8's Mario Boone has been working this story since it began. He joins us with the very latest tonight. Yeah, and the very latest is as those overdoses began to flood into dispatch, emergency workers had no idea what they were facing, so they sent out about 32,000 of these text messages alerting neighbors to be aware. There were five uh, overdoses within a one-hour period. New Haven emergency workers found themselves abruptly flooded Thursday afternoon with a wave of back-to-back -back drug overdoses. So that's pretty sad that things like that are happening in this area. One victim died but was resuscitated. That person now in a medically induced coma. The others rushed to Yale New Haven Hospital ER. This is the Hill neighborhood. It's ground zero where the drug overdoses happened. And what's amazing is on this corner, you'll see a police substation, and directly across the street, you'll notice a schoolhouse. We do not have uh, the exact um, chemical compound that was involved. What they do know is the dope in question is a synthetic strain of weed known as K2. They don't have no idea what's in these drugs. They're just doing them. It's unclear if the K2 was laced with a more powerful agent. Officers have been gathering evidence at each scene. A uh, sample has been sent to the DEA. Isaiah Cave says the lure of quick cash means the dope pushers couldn't care less about the lives they destroy. People have families and people are just out here giving drugs to people that, and they're becoming victims. Now, if you have information about the origin of these dangerous drugs, call the New Haven, New Haven Police Intelligence Unit. We do have that phone number at the bottom of your screen, and we've posted it on our website, WTNH.com. We're live in News 8 Control tonight. I'm Mario Boone, News 8.